To those uh, members that have survived uh, this past summer without the benefit of out-of-state travelers, well done. If you can make it under these circumstances, you can make it under anything. I would say that we learned more about being flexible than anything else this year. You know, it made everybody just stop and go, what do we have? What can we do with it? And let's just push forward and and see what we can do. So in a situation like this where we have to get creative with solutions, figure out new ways to do things, you know, I cannot think of a better industry to be successful at that than ours. Everything in this in the tourism industry is built on relationships. I mean, we had so many combined marketing opportunities and, and so many new partnerships, and I met so many new people. Matt CCB has done a, done a great job of um, updating us with member updates and as well as many of the DMOs across the state. We as an organization invested heavily in an in-state marketing campaign. Alaskans have single-handedly uh, saved my business for this summer. I mean, there's, there's no two ways about it. A lot of Alaskans just getting out and doing things they've never done before. I mean, it was 95% local business. We had spectators that had never been here before supporting a local Alaskan business and just being there. And it's really humbling to see that kind of support for our local business. There's still a desire to travel to Alaska. There's that pent up demand. Whether or not it's boat, you know, cruises to day hikes to biking companies, the interest in coming to Alaska remains. We've got all the ingredients and, and the people are, are going to still want them and, uh, and we'll be there to deliver. We can definitely provide a quality um, experience for people. You have a little more space, you encourage people to get outside, um, be a little bit more independent. I mean, you know, what a great place to social distance, right? We were able to operate safely and keep everybody uh, entertained at the same time. I think that Alaskans will, especially in the tourism industry, maintain that light of hope that we will see this turn around and we'll come back stronger and better than ever before. We're a very resilient industry. We came back after 9-11, we came back after previous economic downturns. Uh, it's been a very unique year for sure, but the experience, it really, it really feels more Alaskan to me. And I'm really enjoying that. I've had more fun this summer uh, than I have in the last six summers. Um, and I think that's just because it was quality over quantity. You know, um, I got to share my story. I get to hear the guest story. It just really remind me why I'm in uh, hospitality to begin with. As a member of Matsu CVB's board of directors. I want to take a moment to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your support. We know this has been a terribly difficult year, but we are dedicated to providing you with the resources you need to recover from this crisis stronger than ever. Please don't hesitate to reach out during these challenging times. We're here to serve you. We're, We're here, here to, to serve, serve you. you. We're proud to be part of Alaska's tourism industry and a key player in its full recovery. We know that we are going to get through this by working together and supporting each other. We're here for you. We're here for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you for, for your, your support. support.